it is the afternoon of July 19. Yes, it looks like I have I have my video cricket, but I'm actually level and the bobcat's not. So we're doing our excavation of the footing. And what I do is I take our 38-pound demolition hammer with a chisel and, uh, and chisel the line exactly where we want to make the cut. So the benefit of doing that is we chisel down about six inches and when the excavator comes in, he already knows where not only where to dig, but the first six inches provide a nice square, a nice square cut. So let's, let me walk to the end. It's amazing how much spoilage that is the extra material you get when you dig a trench. So I got a lot of dirt to deal with over the next couple of days. Now, since Randy is at an angle, uh, his excavator is going to cut this way just because there isn't any way to upright his blade if, his, if the entire unit is pitched like 5 to 10 degrees. So I guess fortunately slash unfortunately, I was expecting to see rock a little bit sooner. We're not into the rock yet. Aside from, don't know if you can see it, when I'm looking at the camera, I can't see anything, it just looks dark. There's a root and there are lots of little roots that are that we've gone through with the excavator, but looks like we have very little chopping to do. I'm making a two foot footing. It's gonna go down about two feet. Some of this I'm gonna excavate out a little bit and we may have to dig our footing a little bit deeper there. But for the most part, this is a good first cut. I don't wanna go too deep. Tomorrow, if uh, Bobcat of Fremont has a rock bit available, I will I'll go get that and we can drill holes about every four concrete blocks at 64 inches. And uh, we're gonna drill all the way down to rock. So we have something to set the wall. It's actually, this isn't really a wall. It's more of a guardrail. It's not even a guard, but it's a curb. So, uh, and on the right side of where Frankie is sweeping, we will have another shorter footing that we'll use and and we'll have a planter between where Frankie is and where the other footing goes. This will be a planter space. So that allows me to do a number of things. That's something I already discussed and we can talk about later, but um, dirt is coming out of the ground. What's the guy in the hole for? He makes sure that uh, the, the excavator gets everything removed. He also cleans off the left-hand side uh, and the right hand side as uh, the excavator is digging. It's, uh, it's it, When we first get started, there's as much dirt on the sides as there is in the hole to come out. But now that he's actually gotten going, I don't know that there's that much to do, but Frankie's just making sure that everything is square before Randy gets too far ahead. That's it. Okay, another day. And in the backyard, that's probably that's a whole nother video. Let's talk about that in another.